All right, it's pretty much of a late review, but this is the Google Nest doorbell battery operated. Um, I don't have it wired. Uh, so right now it's pretty much charging. This is the QR code that you uh, you would scan on your phone to actually set up the doorbell. Um, the doorbell is really good. I, I like how the chime sounds. It's got this l nice illuminated lights that uh, pop up every time when someone rings the doorbell. Uh, it does have a little LED light right here. It'll turn red if it's recording. Uh, be mindful though, when you're using this doorbell, you have to make sure that there's a certain degrees. I'm just not remembering right now, but there's a certain degrees that if it's too low that it won't record or you won't be able to see any live videos because it's too cold outside. So I would recommend that you take off the doorbell and, and keep it in the house until you know the temperature actually picks back up. I think it's around I think 20, 21 or less than 20 degrees. I'm not sure. I, you guys got to quote me on that, try to figure it out. But yeah, it's charging now. And then if you try to hit the doorbell, the battery is 40% charged. It'll be fully charged in about three hours. It'll say that while it's charging. Um, and then if you have other Google products like the Google Home Mini or the Max, uh, you can have them uh, attached with this so uh, you can hear the door, the doorbell from outside. Uh, but yeah, it's really nice. It, ha it also has night vision uh, so you can see in the dark and it has a nice field of view in terms of how you're able to see if anyone passes by your home. But yeah, definitely get this product and this is good. They also have it in black as well. I prefer the white because my door is white in my home. Um, but yeah, definitely this rocks.